Google AI Studio provides easy access to tons of artificial intelligence tools, and we can interact with AI using more than just text prompts. From the Stream tab, we can consult with AI in real time by talking with Gemini Live, sharing our screen, or even by connecting our webcam. And this is a dynamic way to get real-time analysis with AI, personalized advice, or instant feedback on projects. And talking with Gemini Live is like having your own personal assistant brainstorming with you in your office. So let's head over to Google AI Studio and go over how to interact with AI in real time. To access the free AI tools on Google AI Studio, go ahead and click the link in the video description. So once you get to Google AI Studio, go ahead and look at the menu on the left hand side and go to the Stream tab. Here's where we can talk with Gemini Live, share our screen, and when we connect our webcam, we'll see the webcam button pop up here as well. So for our first example in the Stream tab, let's go over how to use the Talk feature. With the talk feature, we can use voice input to ask Gemini for creative ideas in real time. It'll even talk back to us and respond in one of 30 different voices that we can select from. If you wanted to change the AI voice, simply use the drop down menu here. But for this example, I'm just going to stick with the default voice. So let's say I want to grow my digital marketing agency and I want to talk with Gemini to come up with some ideas. To begin a back and forth dialogue, let's click the talk button here. If this is your first time using the talk feature, you'll need to use the pop-up window here to allow Google to access your microphone. Now when I hit the talk tab, the stream should go live and I should be able to start talking with AI. So Gemini, give me three social media marketing campaign ideas to help grow my digital marketing agency. Okay, here are three social media campaign ideas to help grow your digital marketing agency. You could run a campaign providing valuable marketing tips and insights. Share industry knowledge and position your agency as a thought leader. Consider a campaign offering a free consultation or digital marketing audit. This is a great way to attract potential clients and showcase your services. Not bad. It answered my question and the voice was easy to understand. Feel free to brainstorm back and forth with AI as much as you like. All of your responses will be available here in text and audio versions. And once you're finished, you can end the stream by clicking the icon here. The options will then be available here to resume your stream or start a brand new stream. So as you can see, being able to talk directly with AI is a great way to brainstorm ideas. But from the stream tab, we can also have AI analyze our screen by using the share screen feature. This allows Gemini to analyze our websites, ads, or anything else on our screen in order to brainstorm ideas and suggest improvements. So to test it out, let's click the share screen button here. This will display a menu where we can select to show our browser tab, a specific window, or our entire screen. For this example, I'm going to use the Facebook post I was working on earlier and see if AI can analyze it if I share my screen and provide me with some good hashtags to boost the post's reach. The post is about launching a website for my digital marketing agency, so let's see what it comes up with. So from the window tab here, let's select the one showing my Facebook post, then click the share button at the bottom right. And my screen is now being shared with Gemini. Since we're on the stream tab, to analyze my window, I can simply start chatting with AI. So Gemini, what hashtags should I use to help boost this post's reach? Since your post is about a website launch, consider using hashtags like hashtag website launch, hashtag new website, or hashtag online business. Those can help your post reach people interested in new online resources. Not bad. Gemini was able to see my screen and provide me with some suggestions. Feel free to brainstorm with Gemini as much as you like. And once you're finished, you can click stop sharing and both the audio and the text will be available. I can now take my hashtags and my other suggestions and use them to improve my Facebook posts for my website launch. For brainstorming ideas and being able to share your screen with AI is a real game changer. So we've gone over how to use the talk and the share screen features. Now let's go over how to connect our webcam to interact with AI. When you plug in your webcam, you should see the webcam button appear on the screen. So now that I've connected my webcam, let's click the webcam button and see if we can interact with AI. This will take you over to the chat screen where you can simply start talking with Gemini. So let's test it out and see how it works. Hey Google, what is this and what is it used for? That looks like a VR headset. It's used for immersive virtual reality experiences, allowing you to feel like you're in a different world or playing interactive games. Where can I purchase one of these? You can typically buy VR headsets at electronic stores, online retailers like Amazon, or directly from the manufacturer's websites. 
awesome, thanks. And once you're done chatting with Gemini, you can simply go to the bottom here and click the disconnect button. Feel free to download the audio files or start a new chat if you like. So that's a quick overview of how to use the stream tab on Google AI Studio. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.